four ways to engage visitors and increase traffic to your center. Nearly 80% of U.S. Internet visitors spend roughly five hours watching a video throughout the day, and they will uh, average about three and a half minutes per video. Video is growing daily. Therefore, here are four ways that you can actually improve your business uh, in connecting to your visitors, to your donors, to your volunteers using video to engage them and increase traffic back to your center. And the first step is to solve a problem. Create a video that addresses or solves your prospect's problem. After all, that's the point of your center, helping people solve their problems. And this video doesn't have to be an Oscar winner, just very clear and very concise. Use pictures, charts, and examples to tell your story. A webcam, a screen capture product like Camtasia, or even one of these little uh, Flip or Kodak camera works well to create a, a movie uh, that doesn't break the bank. You can use a simple voiceover or add a PowerPoint type slideshow or a keynote slide presentation. Stay focused on helping your visitors without overselling your center or preaching pro-life to them. Encourage them to request a free report or to call you or to come by to ask for more questions. Number two, be human. Use video to put a human face of your center. Let your clients meet the staff counselor or the nurse manager. Even you, the director, could introduce yourself on this video. The technique can be very effective for service providers. Let your visitors experience you so they can get a firsthand feel of your unique brand of customer service, your personality, your friendliness, your warmth. There's a reason why, for example, dating services use video exclusively. People want to know you before they start uh, to work with you or to have a relationship with you. And the same principle is true for those visiting your center's website. Now, number three, consider demonstration videos. Create videos that demonstrate your services in action since you cannot physically place that item out in your visitor's hands on the other side of that monitor. Let them see into your center. Real action is always the best. It's better yet to have your own clients who you have made a positive choice and who appreciate your center be your voice. Let them send you a video, them commenting about your service. Collect five or ten of these and then make a video of what people have to say about your center. As the director, introduce yourself. Share your vision. Let your nurse manager tell about the sonograms. Let your after abortion leader and a small group be seen to give them an idea of what it might be if they connect with your center. Don't make this a big production because you can add this to your site and it can be so simple. You can even try videoing testimonials describing before and after experiences. Make these short 30 second how to use videos and add them to your site. Add them to your site regularly and I promise you are going to see a greater return in the calls and visits to your center and there's going to be a fewer page bounces or drop-offs from your website. Now finally show visitors that you care. Make a video about a community project that matters to your center. Uh, create a short film or a slideshow showing your center's involvement with charities or sponsored events. If you have a, a walkathon, a banquet, special events like that, create a short slideshow or video about what your center is involved with. And remember, donors support people. They don't support computers or websites. So let me wrap this up for you. Note that the key to successfully using video is not doing wacky stunts or whiz-bang Hollywood effects. It is your ability to simply become more personable, helpful, or relevant to your visitor. The idea is quite simple. Use video to replicate how you interact with live customers. The advantage is this customer service helper who works 24 hours a day. Don't try to replace human contact. In other words, think about your customer service, especially on the phone and those who first engage your clients when they walk into the center. And don't let what we're talking about here about increasing your video replace the human contact at the center. But until we meet again, if you need help with video for your center, 
please give me a chance to serve you through the other hat that I wear, that of Senior Web Consultant and Managing Director of AWS Creative Solutions, LLC. My phone number is 214-703-0505. And remember, until we meet again next week, keep up the good work that you do. You are making a difference, and the other side just can't stand it. Thanks for listening. 